What up, what up, what up, what up? We got a uh, 2006 300. And we're doing this right here. That's not the thermostat. It's called a water outlet or a coolant outlet. As you can see, hold on, I'm gonna show you. It's got a big ass motherfucking hole right there. Like I stick my screwdriver in it. That shit all busted. All of that big ass hole right there. So, it's really, I mean, it's not complicated. You got two, I believe those are sevens or six, I think seven millimeters. And these are eights. So you got these two eights on the top, these two eights in the back. <clears throat> You got a bleeder valve, which you're not gonna need until you're done. So you just take off these two sevens and these four eight millimeters, and that's it. Uh, and I'm gonna give you some little tips, and then you just like pull this back, and uh, I'll go through it here. I'm just gonna loosen those up, and then we'll get back to it. The part number, if you need it, is uh, Dorman 902301. As you can see, it's called a coolant air bleeder, but some people call it a water outlet cooling outlet it is not a thermostat <sighs> right, so when you look at them right away it might look like this has two bleeder valves but it doesn't this is actually I would just I, I just took that out just because you don't have to um, so I'm gonna tell you right now it was a pain in the ass to slide that off so what I did is um, this goes on here and between this right here and this right here I took a pry bar and just like pushed it pushed it that way against this to slide this off because it's kind of tough to get it off so um the reason is because of this o-ring which needs to be changed so make sure you put the new o-ring on maybe clean this up if you have to um and then the new part should which it does come with new gaskets and as you can see uh, this one right here new part and the old part, you got a big hole in it. Okay. And uh, I'm probably going to save this bleeder valve for future. All right. So I'm going to put this on, clean all that up, and clean all that shit up. Switch out your gasket. Line these up. Then put a little coolant on your o ring. And then uh, top it off with coolant. And then boom, you should be good to go. It's a 2.7 liter motor. It's an 06 Chrysler 300. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Peace.